Hello friends, welcome to MFC Programming Tutorial. Today we are going to learn how to create dockable pane window in MFC application. Let's open Visual Studio first. Go to File, New, Project, select Visual C++, MFC, select MFC application give the name of the application that you want I'll give it as dockable pane press ok next in application type dialog multiple documents checked uncheck tab document uncheck the tab documents go to next 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 under user interface features use check use a ribbon use a ribbon check next under advanced feature uncheck these th three features click finish once you click finish you will have a project created successful you can see once your project is created successful you can see this project creation successful then let's do Go to view open solution explorer. You open solution first. Let's so we need to open solution. If you see this by default, these many folders are created by the framework. We have to first remember we have to create now. We have to create dockable pen. Before creating dockable pen, let's see <coughs> this is also a kind of dockable pen. One example of dockable pen. So first we need to open a so from view we have to open solution explorer then you can see the then we have to open class wizard to add a class that derives from C dockable pen for that press shortcut key control shift x to open MFC class wizard if you have to press control shift x to open MFC class wizard. See the MFC class wizard has opened. Now let's add a class that derived from C document. I'll give the name as C doc C doc pain exp and select base class as CD C doc pain click finish base class as c doc cable pen and name that you want to give but don't give both are same it should be print c doc cable pen click finish apply ok now we have a class we have a class that derived from c doc cable pen now let's go to view solution explorer From Solution Explorer, you can see that under source file, you have mainframe.cpp, open this, and under header files, you have resource.h, sorry, don't open this, you have mainframe.h, open this, change the font, I'll change it font, change the font, and then in mainframe, let's create a instant member pointer variable of this class, copy this, to mainframe dot h create a instance of this pointer variable p doc pane and let's include the header file as include doc we have created c doc pane dot txp dot h so this head this class is declared in this header file we are in so next come to mainframe.cpp in mainframe.cpp come to constructor this constructor come to constructor definition of this constructor see mainframe frame definition of the constructor in mainframe.cpp and assign this variable to null 
now the pointer is the pointer that we created here in main frame dot as in main frame dot cp i am assigning it to null next go to view go to view resource view select resource view in resource view expand this expand this button this is also a kind of dockable pen that if you see resource view is a dockable pen also so from resource view ribbon from ribbon idr ribbon here again go to view toolbox from toolbox select a, select a button and drag and drop to this area right click now whenever i press this button we have a dialog or toggle pen window should get display for that we need to add a handler first let's up change the properties of this button right click on this button properties from property let's change the caption i'll give it as dock cable pen dock cable pen and give it as it is so you can see the change so now let's add a handler for this right click on this button add event handler and select this command and from here select c main frame c main frame from this class list and give the name of the handler that you want i'll give it as dock pen now press add and did it now you can see the handler is created for you so whenever i press this button main frame dot cpp this handler will get cut and it will this create and display a dockable pen similar kind of this for that we need to add code snippet i have already prepared the code snippet i'll copy this and paste it here now you can see it here now we have created this dock pen variable of this class so copy main come to main frame i'll give this variable here as here so this dog pen is of pointer variable this dog pen is of this class type so in main frame instantiate it and then i am creating it i'll close this dog pen you can see we have to give we are creating it and we have to give a id id for this dock cable pen that we are name this name is that it will get, get display when the dock cable pen will be displayed so we need to def, this it is saying undefined this id is undefined so copy it i'll copy it and define it first before using we need to define control z has defined Okay, now we have define it. Go to our handler function on dock pen. Now you can see the error has gone. Now first time it is null as we have assigned this variable as null null in constructor. If you come here, you select this C main frame. Select here C main frame and here also. C main frame. Here we have assigned this variable as null. So come to again in main frame, our handler function. Now here we are creating this dockable pen and giving name as this and uh, this web string and handler as this. Next we are enabling the docking anywhere we want. Then finally we are showing it. we are showing after doing after docking and then finally we are showing in i am giving auto hide mode as disabled first and let's build this we can type this code to your application this lines of code to your application with all the stuff for whatever i showed in this video you have followed this lines of code you can 
add in your application let's build it to build 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 it you can see this code and you can type this now you can see the build has such a rebuild i gave rebuild you can give in so now you can see the build succeeded rebuild succeeded is one now let's run it so let's maximize this application maximize this now whenever i press docker pen you can see docker pen the name that i we have given here is docker pen docker pen so here it is showing docker pen so you can and pin it pin it so you can see you can close this again press the docker pen will come so this is today we learned how to add docker pen in mfc let's close this the major step that you have to follow is you have to open a class wizard using pressing con pressing control shift x then you have to add a class as we did here class that derives from c docker pen then we have to create a instance of the class that we created here in main frame pointer then pointer we have assign this pointer in constructor null then we have created we have added a button and for this button we have added a handler function in main frame you can see this handler function in main frame handler function when we have to add this many lines of code this many lines of code in our application then you have to finally build and run then you will get a docker pen get a docker pen like this after doing all the step thanks for watching please give any comment if you have any question any query if you have